On anyhow, must be rolling. You know, we're going big time in Frazee. Okay. Well, how? <laughs> well, you just What's had a, you just had a customer, the first customer this morning, and we're going big time, like IBM, RCA, GE. You know. So what are we? BYS. BYS. But you know what? I thought you were talking. <laughs> the guy that called a few days ago and placed this great big order. He's a loyal fan of ours on YouTube. Gotta love that. And he placed a we have to ship all this heavy stuff to we're like, are you Iowa? To Iowa. And Ogden, I'm like, are Ogden, you sure Ogden. this stuff is fact, heavy to you'll ship? You'll probably be listening. Yes. Ogden, Iowa. Yeah. He yeah. says, I want to support His name you is guys. Roger, R O D. D with a D. Yeah. Yes. He made that clear when I talked to him. So, <laughs> yeah, so we are going big time, see? <laughs> yeah. Not just BYS. Hey, we had Stan Tequila here last week and what a treat. What a what? tree. And what knowledge he's got of birds and stuff. You know, he spoke at the high school on wolves on Friday night. And I thought it was kind of interesting because I think there were their fair share of people that would like to kill the wolves because they're killing their farm things. Mm. But he handled it all really well and gave a lot of good points on the wolves. And Well, I'll tell you what. I, I'm, I'm one that really don't like the wolves. Okay. Totally. But I, I really, after listening to that, I'm kind of against having a season, season. for them. I mean, if they're mm -hmm. being killed, that's one thing. But to go out and kill, kill them, because if you kill the main one, it, it, the pack goes nuts. So. so he was in the store here then on Saturday morning doing book signing. So we had him sign a whole bunch of books that we bought and we kept in the store. We buy? We, yeah, we buy. Then we keep them in the store. We've got all these Minnesota books, mammals, Minnesota, fish of Minnesota, trees of Texas? How'd that get up here? <laughs> uh, birds of prey. And he assigned all of these. Ducks and geese. Well, so, here, like this bear one, he signed a whole, in fact, he signed uh, books whenever he had a free moment. He was signing books that we kept. Hey, these here kids' the books. Kids' are, board books are so cute. And I have to say, I had picked a bunch of these out for a grandson of mine who's going to turn one in just a week or so. Yeah. Oh, he just did last week. And you didn't send Sorry, a card? Sorry, I missed it. I, I've got... <laughs> I bought four books for him. Um, and Stan says, oh, I haven't seen these books yet. I'm like, really? And he said, yeah, they just came out on Tuesday, and they shipped them to you on Wednesday, and I haven't seen them yet. So, peepers and peekers. Oh, and he didn't know where to sign them. He ended up signing them on the back. Oh, and I like Peepers. this one here. It says, uh, here, this is a cricket. The, the white spot on my, it says, where's the cricket's where's ears? ears? I didn't know. I thought it was on his head, but it's not. It's on their little leg. It's a little white spot on their leg. Snouts and sniffers, yeah. paws and claws. I mean, yeah, what cute floppers, names yeah. for these books. But he's also got a, he's a photographer, a, a, an incredible photographer. And these are like what you would almost call your coffee table books because they've got so many good photos well, in Well, but there's a lot of good information he's on there. He's got eagles, owls, woodpeckers, uh, hummingbirds, loons, the baby bears, the other bears, the wolves. And then besides Stan Tequila books, we have a lot of books in our store. We've got a lot of excellent cookbooks. Oh, you're going to talk some more about Stan Tequila. No, no. This is, okay. this is excellent. The whole package deal. You get the CD, the whole thing. And in the book, it tells you what to go to the CD. And, and then it and gives to listen the to the sound of sounds the of the birds, and then the, there's a, a narration of uh -huh. what the bird is doing and stuff. You know, some of the cookbooks that we have are raspberry, uh, the whole book is raspberries, strawberries, cherries, uh, rhubarb, uh, cranberries. I thought you weren't going to buy this Twin City. I didn't. One. Who you did? did? No, I didn't. I didn't do that. We've got crossword puzzle books. We've got journals. We've got a disagreement hey, going on. Hey, <laughs> this guy here, this is a good book. This little, is cute. Wolf Lake is in this uh, little Minnesota book. Towns neat, with like a neat, population of 100. Yeah. guy was in last week and he said, this is one of my favorite books. He said, I'm going around to all these little towns and singing. Checking them out after yeah. he's reading the book. We've got a horrible display of our books, but we've got a lot of good books in the store. So What do you mean we've got a horrible display? We've got a horrible display. <laughs> for, we have too many books for a small space. That's not good. What we need is more space. I wasn't going to even say that. 
come on in the store and check out our books. We've got lots of good ones. And a lot of them now signed by Stan Tequila. Yep. I'm Diane. Hey, I'm Roger. Downtown state, downtown backyard station, downtown B -Y -S. crazy. <laughs> well, they might get mixed up with uh, another place oh, in I a don't. neighboring town. Uh, <laughs> backyard station in Frazy. 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 I might add that in Frazy, Minnesota. <laughs>